How's everyone doing? This is going to be another for sale video, and this one is going to be a cheapy video essentially where every Blu-ray is $3 and every DVD is $2. And uh, you have to buy at least $9 worth for it to make me to make it worth me shipping it out. Uh, and that is before shipping. Uh, shipping is $3 in the continental US up to five movies. Uh, then from there, probably like a dollar more depending on what you how many you buy. Uh, but shipping in the continental U.S. only because it's really not worth it to you as the buyer to pay the shipping costs because uh, shipping two Blu-rays to Canada was 17 bucks, And I can't offer big discounts like, uh, you know, places like Amazon or uh, big companies and stores like that. Um, so you don't have to ask how much for this, how much for that. The prices are already set. They're not going lower. So don't even bother asking. Uh, I think this is, a, you know, a very fair uh, price point here. $3 a Blu-ray, $2 a DVD. Let's go ahead and get into it. PayPal only. If you're interested in anything, leave me a comment down below. We'll do the Blu-rays first. The Eye with Jessica Alba. Love those hollow foil uh, Blu-ray covers. There's another one. American Psycho. Classic. The Shining. Anaconda. My anaconda don't want none unless you got buns, hunts. I don't, every time I hear that, I just think of that. Uh, Ghosts of Mars. Daybreakers. Was that an Ice Cube double feature right there? Ghosts of Mars and Anaconda? Sure was. That was unintentional. Uh, Cronenberg's The Fly. Really good remake. Uh, the G.I. Joe Rise of Cobra has that slipcover. I think this slipcover used to be rare, but I don't care. <laughs> Uh, Battle of the Sexes, Duplicity, The Gun in Betty Lou's Handbag, The Big Picture, Double Team, which I end up getting a duplicate of that and this one, uh, Songwriter, I like those VHS slipcovers though, and a duplicate of this too, uh, Into the Ashes, Little, had a duplicate of this one too, Berlin I Love You. Uh, Bangkok Dangerous, Disorganized Crime, really love the cast in here, King of Thieves, ended up getting a duplicate of that one too, American Pie, Book of Love, Bulldogs, I've got a duplicate of this one in this pile, and a duplicate of this one, which I just showed you a few titles before, Gun and Betty Lou's Handbag, <laughs> duplicates, so many, uh, Van Wilder, I've got like three different editions of this, so I'm getting rid of all of them except for the 4K now. Vincent and Theo. Uh, Theo. <laughs> Talking about the three different editions of Van Wilder. Uh, Evelyn. The Narrows, which is still sealed. Just Getting Started, which is still sealed. A Very Sorted Wedding, which is still sealed. Weird Science. And none of them have digital copies in there. Uh, the Secret Life of Walter Mitty. Garden State. Love that one. Love the soundtrack, too. Uh, the Boy Down the Stairs. Or The Boy Downstairs, rather. Um, let's move these out of the way and not make them fall over. Uh, the next... I'll show these ones last, actually. The next ones are Blockbuster ones. And uh, you can take this paper insert out and put it into a regular Blu-ray replacement case, and you'll never know that it came from Blockbuster. Love Happens. And then No Reservations, both with Aaron Eckhart in there. Uh, Amelia, this one does say rental exclusive down at the bottom. The other ones don't. Uh, it's Complicated. And another title of Old Dogs. And then these ones right here uh, have holes drilled in them. Uh, this one's still sealed, but there's a hole drilled from the back to the front. And I ended up getting another copy of this one. I do really enjoy this movie. Uh, but if anybody's interested in checking the movie out for cheap... And then the same thing with Lords of Chaos. Drilled from the back to the front, I end up getting another copy of it. Uh, same thing with Winter Passing, right there. Uh, New Orleans Music in Exile, through the back but not through the front. So there you go on those. And then to the DVDs. Uh, the Hills Have Eyes 2. I really was keeping this for the slipcover, but I've got the Blu-ray and I've got limited space, so I'm going to let that go. Big Trouble Little China Special Edition. It's a fatty. Uh, these two are actually bootlegs, and I don't think I'd even let them go for two bucks a piece because they're, uh, they were expensive. They were like 20, 25 bucks a pop, like factory press ones and stuff. Uh, back in the day, you know, you 
that's you go to conventions and they'd have them like that. And even now, I think uh, a lot of bootlegs are expensive. Uh, there's a legal loophole if it didn't have the rights or if it's out of print or something like that, you could you could do that. But now these have a uh, double feature release from Scream Factory. So if anyone wants to do a trade for these ones, let me know. Uh, Cannibal the Musical. Castle Freak. Yeah, so those two bootlegs were in here unintentionally. I just trying to get all this stuff together and lost track of what was in there. Uh, but everything else, again, for the DVDs, two bucks. Um, Schwarzenegger and Predator. Classic Glass House. The Fly and The Fly 2. Double feature. These are the uh, remake ones. Thinner. I was keeping this for a while because the Blu-ray doesn't have some of the special features like the audio commentary that the DVD does. But I haven't watched it, and I just, again, I've run out of space uh, as far as... I love the movie, but I haven't watched the special features on there. Transylvania 6 5000. The Witches. Behind Planet of the Apes. Another fatty right there. Special Collector's Edition. Friday. Moulin Rouge. Still sealed up. Not really too into musicals, so... Red Heat and Princess Bride. I was keeping this edition uh, because I remember watching this edition when I was younger a bunch, but I have uh, a signed Blu-ray and then I have the new Criterion Blu-ray. So I was like, you know what? I got to get rid of I had like two other DVDs too. It was like, it's just the space issue. And that's what it comes down to. Because again, like you see all, I've just got like piles just everywhere and like over in that corner. And then, you know, all the bookcases, I've got 11 total bookcases and there's piles over there too that you can't see. So it's just, there's no room. Uh, next up is The Crow. This is the Fatty Collector Series Edition right there. Framed. Jeff Goldblum. Silver, uh, Bullet. About to say Silver Bullet, but this is still sealed. Steve McQueen. The Surface. Sean Astin. Scoop. Woody Allen movie with uh, Hugh Jackman, Scarlett Johansson. Adventures in Babysitting. Love this movie. Uh, this is a triple feature right here. Gun and Betty Lou's Handbag, Gross Anatomy, and Betsy's Wedding. Dumb and Dumber, one of my all-time favorite comedy movies. So ridiculous. Winter's Bone, early Jennifer Lawrence. Donnie Brasco. Silence of the Lambs, which is still sealed up. Special Collector's Edition. Unbridled, which is still sealed. Uh, Meet Bill. TV Classics Bonanza, four episodes. Uh, those are the four episodes right there. This is still sealed. Street Fighter Alpha, the movie. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, the original. Gene Wilder. And yeah, this is an absolute classic. Uh, love the heck out of it. Juice. I remember watching this all the time uh, growing up. The Private Lies of Pippa Lee. Uh, yeah, I, I love the cast here, too. Um, especially uh, Maria Bello and uh, Blake Lively. Are You Here? I really love this movie. I want to get this one on Blu-ray, actually. Uh, I think it was... Uh, people thought it was going to be a raunchy, over-the-top comedy because all these people that are involved with it are usually in those kind of movies, but it's a, it's a dark dramedy. Barbershop 2, which is my favorite of the Barbershop movies. I want to get that on Blu-ray as well. Uh, Van Wilder, which I, I have the, the Blu-ray in here, too. Uh, Men Seeking Women, an early Will Ferrell movie. Good People, which is still sealed with James Franco and uh, Kate Hudson. Some of All Fears, Ben Affleck and Morgan Freeman. I remember seeing that in the theaters. Real World, You Never Saw, Back to New York with The Miz. Still sealed, by the way. Dear Mr. Wonderful with Joe Pesci, which is still sealed. Uh, this is like one of those ones that you would get at the grocery store, kind of like an off-brand where it says DVD movie down there. Going the Distance. This was a Blockbuster one right there. Uh, Valentine's Day, another one that was from Blockbuster. Great cast in there, though, for the most part. Uh, 500 Days of Summer, or as I affectionately like to call it, 500 Days of Bummer. I think I'm like the only person that doesn't like that movie. Uh, Cocktail with Tom Cruise. Love that movie. Miss Julie. Don't Tell Mom the Babysitter's Dead. Classic. I Am Sam, remember seeing that in the theater, very emotional movie. Into the Ashes, which I've gotten so many multiple copies of this too, which this is still sealed, this one. Uh, Irresistible, with uh, early Emily Blunt role, Sam Neill and Susan Sarandon. 
Wonder Boys. Great cast here, too. The Born Ultimatum, which is still sealed. Batteries not included. Uh, Jeremiah Johnson, classic. All the Pretty Horses. Spaceballs, one of my all-time favorite comedy movies. May the Schwartz be with you. Uh, Patriot, which is still sealed. Die Hard with a Vengeance, which is still sealed. Uh, the Longest Yard, the original with Burt Reynolds. Money Train, another Wesley Snipes, Woody Harrelson team up. Uh, they do really well together. I like them in White Men Can't Jump as well. Field of Dreams, one of my all-time favorite movies. Uh, Neighbors, I remember I bought this for like, I don't know, 15 bucks, 20 bucks, something like that. It was one of those like, uh, I think Burn On Demand ones at the time. Um, and all those Burn On Demand ones are way overpriced, in my opinion. But uh, crazy movie. Great cast in there, too. Uh, Angel of Death. Zoe Bell. Uh, Martian Child. Beer League. The Toy. With Richard Pryor and Jackie Gleason. This is still sealed. Uh, I paid 8 bucks for it. and never opened it, but I do have it on Blu-ray. Love that movie. Uh, Lola, which is another... Uh, off-brand gray market one that you'd see at the supermarket with uh, Charles Bronson. Forks Over Knives, which is still sealed. An Inconvenient Truth. Before the Flood. I Am the Blues. Uh, Death Cab for Cutie on the road with them. I drive well, sleep carefully. And a bunch of special features on there, live performances and stuff. Bowling for Columbine. And then Original Sin Sex, National Geographic. This is a two-disc edition, still sealed up. So there you go. That is everything. $2 per DVD, except for the two bootlegs. I'm only going to do trades for that because I really shouldn't be selling them, and especially not for that cheap anyways. <laughs> uh, even though they're bootlegs, they're nice bootlegs. They're good bootlegs, uh, quality, and they were expensive as heck. <laughs> and uh, the Blu-rays are 3 bucks a pop. So, yeah, again, 3 bucks for the Blu-rays, 2 bucks for the DVDs. Uh, you have to buy at least $9 worth to make it worth my uh, time and effort to ship them to go to the post office and package them all up. Uh, and that is before shipping. Shipping is $3 in the continental U.S. Um, and, again, depending on how many you buy. Uh, if you buy, you know, over 5 it would be like a dollar more. Um, so there you go. PayPal only shipping the continental U.S. only. Three bucks of Blu-ray, two bucks of DVD. Uh, leave me a comment down below if you're interested in anything, and I'm hoping to move a bunch of these. I just sold uh, like 40 to uh, one person uh, before I made this video, and that kind of like motivated me to make a cheapy video. Uh, and then somebody else bought like 10, so I'm moving some, but I still have a ton more to move. I really need to uh, make some uh, decisions and get rid of more titles. Um, I just don't have the room is the thing. But uh, that's it for right now in this video for the cheapy video. So let me know if you're interested in anything. Hope everybody's doing well. Take care.